Hey guys, welcome back. As you can see, I'm back to working on R2. Uh, for the next couple of sessions, I'm going to be focusing on his dome. Earlier, my dad helped me use a, um, oh, what do they call it? Uh, a jigsaw to cut out the bottom so that way the head will be hollow and not, you know, solid, or at least solid looking. What I'm doing now is putting, like, sort of pie slices on the top, I guess you could call them. This is the first one. It's going to go right... Where is it? It goes somewhere where it goes like that? Yeah. It goes like, yeah, anyway. I'm going to secure it as well as I can like that. With some hot glue. And then we'll go from there. Okay, one down, 11 to go. I'm going to have to make each of these uh, custom for every single side because uh, these, I was not very careful in measuring out where these ribs were going to go and they're not all perfectly even, so I'm just going to have to play it by ear. Okay, well, I would call this thing about half done, but I messed up. I was supposed to put two of these back here, but I put one of them centered, so yeah, I messed up. And that, it doesn't look that good, and now I'm going to have to figure out how to make covers for the other sides, so yeah. <laughs> I could just take this off, I guess, but I don't know how to remelt some um, hot glue. Um, I'll come back when I figure out this problem. <laughs> Okay guys, it's been five hours. I'm still pretty much stumped as to how to fix this thing. The only thing I can figure is making three separate pieces to go in here, secured here, and then here, and then try and figure out some way to put it in here, or just put more ribs in the middle. But it's after five o'clock, I have run out of time, so, I'm going to have to get back to R2 tomorrow in between doing Fan Art Friday. So, poor R2 is going to have to wait another night before I can completely cover the rest of his dome. But I know after his dome is covered and trimmed, he will look a lot more like himself. So, that's all for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'm sorry today was something of an anticlimax, but, um, this is what happens when you get distracted and still have a heck of a lot of work to do. <laughs> My bad. I blame only myself. So, I need to figure out how to fix this thing, <laughs> and then do that tomorrow. Question of the day. Do you have any suggestions on how I can fix this other than taking this thing off and moving it? Because I don't have a heat gun. We don't even have a, um, a, um, a hairdryer that goes very high. So it's not like I can remelt this. I don't have any way to melt this hot glue again. So suggestions. I need to know how I can fix R2 without too much more trouble and still have everything flush so I can, you know, put some masking tape over it, finish it off, and make it look nice and smooth before it's painted. Or maybe I'll put paper mache over it. I haven't made up my mind yet. So suggestions, please drop a comment below. I need help with this guy. <laughs> but uh, until tomorrow, this is the Clumsy Jedi signing off. Bye, guys.